Hey, fire signs, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Um, take whatever resonates, you guys. Leave whatever don't. Everything may not resonate with everyone because this is a general message, not a personal. If you want a personal, you could definitely book one with me. That information is listed in the description of this video along with so much more other information. Um... Uh, like extended readings, um, also meditation, also um, chakra readings, and um, crystal, uh, and so much more is in Patreon. You can um, go there. The link is also listed in a description. You could go there, choose whichever membership you would like. But I'm going to do your weekly, you guys, and I'm going to give you... Like the sum, the main message, and then I'll elaborate on that in the extended, give way more detail due to what's going on in your situation. Okay? All right. Um, for those who are new, I am a psychic medium. Um, the spiel is real. I have to give the spiel because some people are new and you don't know me. So. Um, again, for those who are new to the channel, I am a psychic medium, so, uh, I do Q&As, and in those Q&As, I do not use any cards or any tools whatsoever, just strictly vision, okay? Um, you can check me out in past live videos, whether here or in Facebook, where it originally came out in. <laughs> uh, you can check me out in reviews, just look me up, okay? Um, read my about me sections, more details on what I can do and how or whatnot. Um, but if you want to reach out to a deceased loved one, I am that person. Um, I am a genuine medium, okay? Psychic, that is. Psychic medium. So, uh, yeah, tune in on Mondays. I'm going to start doing Q&As on Mondays. Uh, I haven't figured out the exact time, but... I will definitely let you know once I get things back in order since I'm back, you know, now in YouTube. I'm also in a psychic medium site as well. Check me out there. Um, again, all information listed in the description of this video. All right, you guys, let's get started with Aries. Aries, spirit, please show us a message for Aries. Aries, Aries, let's do the message for Aries, 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 hmm. thank you. All right, Aries, what is it? Show us a message for Aries. 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 And what else for Aries? And one more for Aries. One more for Aries. Aries. Thank you. Alright, someone could be married here or in some type of commitment. Uh, someone wants some payback, wants, some, wants to punish you or you want to punish this person. Or this could be a long-term relationship someone could be in or was in. But yeah, they tuned in to you. It's like they're watching your every move or this is you. Take it however. Alright, that's not everybody's message. Just take whatever resonates, of course, and leave whatever don't. Um, also check your moon, your rising, your Venus, all that good stuff. Don't forget your natal chart. That link is also listed in the description if you do not know your natal chart. All right. But, uh, there's some si is silence going on. Okay. It's crickets. It is non-action. Um, but it's a lot of watching, a lot of spying, a lot of, um, just watching. I don't feel like this is... 
at least in it, you have two energies here. One, one is someone who's wanting to pretty much wanting some revenge because of mm, I don't know whatever but this breakup yeah someone is like someone want revenge want to um, punish you or vice versa or if this was like if this was say for instance this was mutual you and this person decided okay let's go our separate ways you may feel like okay good we're done it's over but it's it's, it's an energy here that don't feel that way okay someone is is not too fond of this and they want to retaliate okay whether this is you or this person or ex however but um then you have another energy here who's uh, you, someone could be watching someone, but not much communication. There's nothing being said, but it's a lot of reminiscing, um, memories. Someone is recalling, like, the past with someone. And someone is wanting to return, okay? We have return. Confirmation. <laughs> Confirmation, Aries. Let's get more on this energy for Aries. Your energy, Aries, King of Wands. Show us the message for Aries. Show us more on the crickets. On this silence. Show us more on this energy. Maybe uh, if you are in a connection with someone, someone may like to, like, I don't know, shut you out. Don't communicate with you, but yet they're watching you or something. It could be an air sign, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. Or someone could have strong air placements. It's like someone is wanting to seek clarity with someone. Hmm. Show us more on, the, um, on what they're focusing on. Show us more on this energy. Someone could be dealing with the air sign for sure. Someone could be focusing on a Queen of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, energy. This feminine or you could be in the energy of this Queen of Cups. Someone who is very kind, compassionate, loving. Someone who is um, very intuitive. Could be a psychic or very or have some type of um, or just very strong intuitively. Yeah. Like I said, it's, 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 um, it's quiet, but there's watching. It's definitely watching going on. Show us more on this return. Returning, reminiscing spirit. Secretly. Show us more. Someone is wanting to return secretly, but there's a third party situation going on here. Third party could be anyone. Don't necessarily have to be a lover. This could be this could be a, a mother. This could be a father. This could be a friend. This could be a, a ex-lover. Of course, this could be a um, baby mother, baby father. Someone is in the mix here. That could be the person that's wanting retaliation. Wanting to punish you. Or could be a baby father like whoever whoever this ex is it's like they want to retaliate someone could be hurt possibly because of a marriage there's some heartbreak here show us more on the three of swords let me get this deck i feel like someone is taking a break from someone because there's some hidden secrets here yeah that's what's going on. And the hidden secrets could break someone's heart or show us more on the three of swords. But this queen of cups may already know. Or you are in the queen of cups and you already know. Show us more on the three of swords. 
three of swords. Three of swords. For Aries. Aries. Show us more on the three of swords. That someone isn't single. So yeah, someone could be in a relationship. And they didn't share this. Um, and that could be the third party situation. But something about this person. It seemed like someone could be with someone. And that person could be very vengeful. Very vengeful. Very spiteful. It's like someone is wanting to. Um, mm, they may want to retaliate. On the third party. Or, okay, so say for instance, this is a connection, a, a couple. You could be in a relationship. Say you're in a relationship with this person. Confirmation. Somebody. Okay. Someone is in a relationship, <laughs> Aries, with someone. And that someone, whoever they're with, know about the third party. Know about someone that where there's love with or some type of share. Some emotions is there. And someone, whoever this is, is wanting to retaliate. It could be, it could be a breakup going on, or a divorce could have been spoken on. If divorce is the case, if it's just a breakup, that could have been spoke. Um, I mean that that could have could blah, that could have been brought up. And this person wants to retaliate on the other party. Whoever this Queen of Cups is, want they want to retaliate on this person. Unless you're in a Queen of Cups. Take it however. Okay. Um, but someone is not single here. Show us more. On the Nine of Pentacles and Reverse. Yeah, someone could be married. So either you have a third party outside of your marriage. and Or outside of your commitment. However this is. And maybe there's feelings there. Your person know about this. And they want to retaliate on you. Or they want to retaliate on this person. For some of you. This is you. You may have a relationship. And you may want to retaliate on whoever the other person is. Um, or on your person. However, take it, you know, flip it, reverse it if you need to. Because it's different for everyone since this is a general message. If you want a personal, get a personal with me. That way I can just tune in without the cards and see everything, okay? But um, as of right now, like I said, this is general. But I am getting like someone want to cause some type of problems. Let's get one more on the King of Swords. King of Swords, Spirit. King of Swords. Show us more. So it looks like someone is wanting to open up communication with someone. But like I say, I feel like this person is taking a break or you are taking a break from a situation. You're trying to recover and reflect. That's what it looks like. It's like you're trying to mentally prepare yourself for this feminine is, this Queen of Cups is. Um, I feel like they're mentally prepared for whatever it is that this person have to say or you have to say or you're mentally prepared for whatever this person have to say okay um i just realized the king and the queen of cups is here this is a match but this is this energy is separate like this is not the couple the couple is in odd energy it's not it's not even um it's not even the same energy. So I could see the, the, the conflict arising due to the energies. So I don't know. It's, just, it's like someone could be very bossy or controlling. Or they like to dictate. They like to have control. Whether this is you or this could be this person. Um, but it do look like communication is going to open up between someone and another party. Um, it just seemed like it's on hold right now because of a third party. <laughs> Listen, I feel like I'm going in circles, but that's basically what your reading is doing. It's going to circles. Okay, so there's not much movement here. It's quiet. It's silent. It's, it's hidden. Okay? 
It's, it's things that's hidden. Someone feel like that would be best. Someone could be like concerned about hurting someone or breaking someone's heart. But I feel like the person is in an only Queen of Cups. Or um or you're in an annoying. So whatever this is, someone just needs to speak up. But it looks like it's gonna happen anyway. Uh King of Swords here. We have the Ace of Cups, so like I said, it's new love. I feel like someone maybe someone is holding on to conflict, holding on to a relationship that you know it's done, they know it's done, but it's just holding on for what? We got irreconcilable differences, divorce, final, relationship over, like what's what's the hold on? Why why? There's nothing but conflict. Five of swords, it's nothing but stress, anxiety. Someone also someone also could be setting boundaries with someone. Yeah, I feel like, um, yeah, someone could be setting boundaries, a Scorpio possibly, with death here. That could be the energy of this water sign energy. It's two water signs, two king and queen of cups here. So one of them could be Scorpio or just the energy. Okay, um, but it's a lot of like stress and anxiety. Someone is wanting to take, you know, take a leap of faith. But yet guarded and stressed. Like someone is stressed out. Someone is stressed out and you don't have to be or this person don't have to be. You just have to take that leap of faith. Gonna have to be in the full energy. Show us more. Yeah, to go towards wow. This is beautiful. Or for them to come towards you high, but it says Ace of Cups to the <laughs> Knight of Cups. This is someone expressing their feelings, their love for someone. And that's genuine. Genuine love. Got a lot of love here. But then you got someone that's like dictating you or trying to dictate you. It's like strong arm you. Like what the heck? If you a man, you could be dealing with a female that that want total control. Could be very like bossy and then like I don't know. Just in a nasty way or someone just that Anyways, it's not floating your boat, or it's not floating this person boat. Show us uh, more on the Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups. So, yeah, it's like some, someone is guarded, or... I feel like, no. They're trying to tell someone, you want to have to stand your ground and do it. Go after what, do what you want. Go after what you want. This is love. It's like, what What are you doing? Or this person, what are they doing? They need to come towards you. Hmm. Someone could be dealing with a Leo or Taurus or Virgo or Capricorn. And I, I definitely feel like someone could be trying to um, put more time and effort into their money. Someone could be letting go of a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or someone with these placements. Or just someone who's very insecure. It's like someone is insecure. Um, and this could be why they, they try to be over-controlling or whatnot. That's due to insecurities. You don't have to be that way. Whoever this is. Um, I feel like someone played too many games. It's like they, they could be very manipulative. They may play games with you or something. Like try to, I don't know, it's a fire sign. It could be a fire sign or fire placement. Unless this is you, okay? Someone could be stressed out. It could be a Scorpio. Or you could be stressed over a Scorpio. Because someone is wanting to heal a situation. Someone is hoping to heal or to come back together but someone is dealing with way too much conflict like someone bring drama to your life and you have to release this person or you have to set, stand some ground set some boundaries with this nine of wands here you need to invest in what makes you happy basically that's what they're saying with the seven of pentacles knight of cups ace of cups this is where like this could be very real, well grounded um 
more stable, more stability could be coming in for you with another partner or with you moving on or this person moving on from you. Yeah, a new opportunity, possibly even a new job, new money. Someone could actually be receiving new money. If you're still dealing with someone that is in this, this energy of very manipulative, trying to control you or have a say so in your moves or how you do things or whatever, mm -mm. they're going to mess up your money. Because this is what's coming in for you. A whole new opportunity. This is like wealthy. Okay, wealth. Someone could be sitting in wealth. Someone could just be wealthy. Just so wealthy, your soul is wealthy. But someone could actually be financially wealthy. And allowing these energies around you is just going to deplete that. It's going to keep you on a high low, high low. It's going to keep you in balance. So in order for you to keep this energy, keep your stability, you're going to have to release certain people, certain individuals out of your energy. Unless you like to be on a seesaw. <laughs> Unless you like to be on a roller coaster, then hey, that's up to you. But they're telling you exactly what's needed to be done. So sometimes, like, even if it's safer, is, for, for instance, is you on the end where you're having a hard time with letting this person go or letting someone go. It don't have to be, for for most, it don't even, no, it's a lover. It's a lover or an ex-lover, a baby mother, baby father, like whoever, a, a husband or wife. Someone is having a hard time with letting someone go. So this could be you doing this and you're hindering yourself because this these energies is not... It's not, it's not, it's like it was just a lesson to be learned out of this. Not to, you know how certain connections is meant to teach us a lesson. And then certain connections are meant to last for a lifetime. So some of them you try to force to last like a lifetime and you're miserable. Love isn't supposed to be miserable. You should feel happy. You should feel free. It shouldn't be any restrictions, any control. So whatever this is, it's, it gots to go. And someone playing games, someone could be very petty, very childish. They like to get under your skin. That's what it is. So someone needs to move on from this. I'm going to extend this. Wow. If this darn death keep coming out, death keep coming out. So it's time for an ending. It's time for a transformation here. It's time for you to move forward. Also, the chariot, cancer energy, it's time to move forward. So you can have your victory. Confirmation. Thank you. Confirmation. Confirmation. So, yes, you need to move forward. You need to move forward so you can receive your peace. Because it's like the devil is trying to hold on to you. It's trying to keep you back. The devil could be... Look at this, you know? The devil here, and you see... Uh-oh. -uh, it's the other side in the camera. But you see the strings is holding on to this person. He's bent down. His head, hands on his head like he's stressed the heck out. He can't get out of a situation. Yes, you can. <laughs> You're stronger than the devil. Trust me. Don't let this devil weaken you. This devil is working through people or working through this person that you're dealing with, trying to slow you down, keep you stuck and stagnant. It's time for a renewal. It's time for you to find, go back to your soul. Like, look, it's time to go. It's time to free yourself. It's time to find you, find yourself again. Okay. So, um, overall, Overall, it just looked like someone needed to release someone, something, some people. This could be friends. This could be family members. This could be se this could be several people. It just looked like, for most, this is a lover, straight up, down, left and right. Okay. If you don't want to be happy, then don't listen to the message. But if you want to be happy, take heed and do what they're saying. Because if this have hit home for you, then this is your message. If you have to try to figure it out, force it to fit, then it's not your message. It's that simple. But 
they talking to somebody here, Aries. And they talking loud and clear, okay? By the way, I'm a rising Aries. So I have a I have a, a lot of um I kind of resonate with Aries sometimes, but not all the time. But I will say some of my other placements, I may resonate more with my other placements, placements, placements more than I um, resonate with my sun sign. But uh yeah, but this one y'all, this is this is a message for y'all. So Take it however it resonates. Um, it's time to let go. It's time to move on. It's time to break free from something that something, someone, something that is attached to someone that's trying to keep tabs and be attached to you. Mm. You may even feel, like if you share homes with this person, you may even feel the energy. Like, maybe it's, you feel you feel the thickness or you feel like, ugh, I'm, like I'm home. You should come home and be like, ooh, I'm home, you know? But I feel like in this energy, this wh whoever is sharing homes with this person, because whoever this energy is, it ain't right. This ain't right. No, 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 no. Um, if you're not no more, great. Stay out of it. But this energy could, this person definitely could be still trying to keep tabs on you. Or, dang, they wanted to say attack. So they may want to attack you. Again, remember, now that I'm thinking about it, punish. They wanted to punish you. They wanted retaliation on you. It's like when they don't get their way, they get petty and they want revenge. That's how you know someone isn't healed. That's how you know this person need need to heal, go heal themselves. It's not your responsibility to heal them. But um, let's move on to Leo. Jeez. I guess we saved fire signs for lives for a reason. Because I should be done. <laughs> what y'all are reading? All right, uh, thank you so much for tuning in with me, Aries. I wish you nothing, nothing, nothing but the best. Many blessings to you. Um, don't forget to thumbs up, like the video, just show your love and support. If you stay with me this long, something resonated. So thumbs up, like the video, comment below, speak to me, I speak back. Hey, um, I don't care what you say. I Well, just no negativity, you'll be black. <laughs> yes, but... um. Yes, you guys, I'll see you next week. If you do not join me in Patreon, um, I'll be back next week for another weekly message. Um, also, weekend messages, I will provide that as well. So, see you later. Many blessings. All right. Leo. 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 Leo, 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 thank you, all right, Leo, 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 thank you. All right, Leo, someone is sad. Someone is someone is sad. They're feeling alone. They're feeling broken due to. Mm -hmm. Don't tell me why y'all energy. I swear the elements do be having similar energies, but yours kind of similar to Aries in a way, but it's just a little different. A little different. But it looked like someone could be sad, feeling alone in a relationship, in a connection. It's like I'm in a commitment and I'm feeling alone. Someone is realizing something. Something is coming to light for someone. It's definitely someone, some, someone is gaining awareness. They're finding out something. This could be on social media. 
someone could be hiding themselves on social media under a fake profile to gain information. Let's see more for Leo. 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 Leo spirit. Leo. Leo. Yeah, someone done blocked someone. Oh, that's why someone is feeling alone and crushed. Like, dang, you're just going to block me. You're not going to talk to me. There's no communication between you and someone. Someone could be dealing with a Sagittarius. I feel like someone is wanting to balance things out, like come together, bring peace and harmony to a connection. Someone is wanting, you know, is yeah, wanting to bring balance, but I feel like someone is blocking someone out. Someone is someone is feeling hurt because of this. Let me see more on realization for Leo. Show us more realization. Realization. That someone is dealing or just, yeah, someone could have been juggling them. Or they're dealing with another party. Someone is, um, that could be why someone is feeling hurt. Feeling crushed here. Because someone is realizing, dang, you dealing with someone else? It could be like, in a matter of, like a short period of time or something. Like, dang, already... Or that's what that's what that's why you've been quiet, or that's why you've been blocking me, or that's why like something like that. Someone found something out, but it's definitely in social media. But someone is blocked. Someone you block someone, they're watching you through a fake account. Fake account. If if they blocked you, you watching them through a fake fake account. It's one or the other. But let's see more for Leo. Show us more on this energy for Leo. It's like someone is um, being reminded by you with songs and dreams. And it's like, it's like an unhealthy attachment. Show us more on the Two of Swords. Two of Swords. It's like someone... I'm getting like someone could have moved on and never got over got over you. Or you never got over this person, but you've moved on. So that's why someone is still feeling alone because it's like it's it's like someone can never be fulfilled because it's not who you really want. Show us more on the two of swords or who this person really wants. You get me? You know, switch it if need to, reverse it. But, um, someone realizing someone got another party, moved on, or dealing with someone else. Show us more on the Two of Swords. Two of Swords spirit for Leo. Two of Swords. Two of Swords clarified with the Four of Cups. Yeah, it's like someone is missing someone, but there's no communication, no access. <laughs> access denied here. Someone feel, like, left out. We have cancer energy here as well. Show us more on the um, temperance. This two of pentacles, like straight up and down, back and forth. Like someone is juggling. Or I don't even feel like, okay, for some, you could be juggling. You're dealing with someone, dealing with someone, with someone else. Or you could be finding out that your person is dealing with someone else. Or they could be finding out that they're that you're dealing with someone else. Now, for some, this is a situation where you already broken up, and someone may have blocked you, or you blocked this person after y'all broke up, and they end up searching your your social media and they see you talking to somebody else. Oh, that's why they blocked me, or that's why. Yeah, it's like dang. So they they seeing that you're dealing with someone else. Yeah, 
but yet someone is still wanting to recover. Like I said, it's, I feel like someone hasn't gotten over someone. It's like someone is steady missing someone and just want to, like, bring a balance, but maybe too much time went by or show his mom two of pentacles five of swords someone is all up in their head they're conflicted by what they seen i don't know what what the heck they done seen leo but they're not too fond of it they could just see you looking good okay but it just seemed like whatever they seen they they feel like that's why you're blocking out more. That's why you, you're not um, responding to them. I feel like they just block completely. Show us more. Yeah, it's like you're holding back. It's like someone always want to argue. That's why someone is like, no, nah, I'm good. I just, I just hold back. I don't want to talk to you. So someone could be blocking someone because... It's always conflict. It's always arguments. It's always someone trying to... Uh, yeah, two of swords again. It's just no. It's just a no here. It's like someone is... is this is just a no. Someone is flat out saying no. I don't want... I don't want to talk to you. Okay? <laughs> um. So, yeah. I don't know, Leah. This could be you holding back. Matter of fact, your energy not even here. So you could be the one that's blocking this person off. Like you out the picture. For some of you. For some of you it's the other way around. Yeah, someone is setting boundaries, standing their ground. Someone like, nah, I, I'm not bending. Well, they still watching. They still lingering and watching. They could be reaching out, trying to figure out how to reach out to you. Could be through a fake account. <laughs> Show us more. Someone could be dealing with a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. If you're coming out of a relationship, this is why you're coming out of a relationship. Because it could be like a lot of arguments. Pettiness. Even competition. That suck when your lover competing with you and it happens. But um it still it still may bring some emotions to this situation, like sadness because maybe you dealt with this person for some time. Or this person is still mourning over this, like Someone can't get over that someone called it off or don't want this. It's like someone can't get over that. And they're wanting to balance this out. They're like, okay, we're just taking a break. Someone is like, okay, let's just take a break. But then the realization, okay. So this is giving me, maybe something happened, okay, on another note for another couple or whatever. You could have been in, in a relationship. And it just got real toxic or just very argumentative. And, you know, someone just said, you know what? Enough. I'm out. Stop calling. Stop texting. I don't want to kick it. Look, we just. So someone, this person could have blocked you or you could have blocked them. And someone started missing someone. And then someone is like, okay, let's put everything on the table. Let's heal this. Let's work this out. Can we bring balance back into this? So this was just a break for some. Or it's supposed to have been just a... No. For some, someone just wanted this to just be a break. But I feel like on this break, this sounds like something that came up in one of the extended readings. Something similar. Um, I can't remember, but... This realization is giving me like someone sitting back reflecting on their relationship. And they're thinking about it like, wait, I don't know. It's, it seems so imbalanced. It's too much arguing. Like they're starting to realize, you know how when you step away from a situation, you can see it better. And that's what was going on here. 
Like someone had to step away to balance things back back out for themselves mentally about this connection. Like, what what am I doing? Like, why am I holding on to this? I need to set boundaries. Let me message you or message this person that look, I want to be single. I don't feel like this is gonna work. So that could be what's going on too. Like someone could be mess messaging someone and letting them know, I just want to be single. I want to be single. I can't do this anymore. Turn it. Yeah, so look like someone want to be single, but a part of me feel like for some of you, you're going to get back together with this person. Yeah, four of wands just popped out. <laughs> four of wands with the ten of pentacles after the nine of pentacles. It's like be single for some time and then you get back together. And that may just be what you need is a break. Yeah, wow. A reconciliation. So I'm going to extend this, see more details on this. Y'all, fire signs is taking all my time, my energy. Like, what? Y'all reading has been the longest, and I haven't even completed. I got to do Sagittarius. But, yeah. That is what I'm going to, I'm going to stop there. I'm going to extend this and see more details on this situation. Um, if you want to join me in Patreon, you can definitely do that. That information is listed in the description of the video. And if not, um, just stay tuned. Uh, make sure your bells is selected. And I'll post next week for y'all weekly. Uh, but like I said, it's not as detailed as the extended readings. Um, I will be giving a weekend reading as well. So look out for that. Um trying to stay in youtube or come back for good <laughs> let's grow the channel again um and uh don't forget to thumbs up like the video comment you know show your love your support for those who are truly here to support you know i appreciate you and many blessings moving on to sagittarius all right sagittarius Sagittarius, 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 hey Sagittarius, how y'all doing, how my Sagittarius doing, show us a message for Sagittarius. And what else for Sagittarius? Sagittarius. Oh, I'm getting it. I'm a hustler. I'm a, I'm a hustler. I'm a hustler. I'm a, I'm a hustler. Oh, someone could be getting hustled right to jail. We got hustling with the lockbox. Someone hustling right to jail. That's why that song out, came out. We got come together in reverse. So maybe you and a partner not coming together because someone about to get locked up. It could be uh, someone could have been laundering, money laundering, I'm here. Someone could have been doing some, some illegal, something illegal. Yeah, for sure, due to their hustle. Someone could have been stealing from people. Someone could have been um, portraying like they were of good or of God godly or spiritual someone could have been portraying that they were um, of good to take and that's why this is here so this could be someone's karma and this don't necessarily have to be the legal system the the law this could be spiritual spiritual law someone could have been trying to take from an innocent being an innocent um yeah someone innocent or many innocent people okay so you could have been one of them this don't necessarily for some this could be so spiritual or this is not money they could have been trying to take from you energetically this could have been like an energy vampire 
someone who knew you had a good soul and they wanted to take to feed off of you okay so that could be the message for some but someone is you know god don't like ugly the universe don't like ugly karma is real what y'all see me just shuffle the deck right and then i looked up picked up and look what's that the devil oh yeah someone is going down because it's wrong it's wrong it's history now it's history it's over it's over okay it's over whatever this is that was trying to take 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 from you ooh. Mm, mm, mm. yeah power they want his power this is the devil here together oh yeah they wanted a leaps. This could have been a leader of some sort that was portraying themselves as a good, genuine leader. But they were actually doing demonic things, um, devilish, devious things to people. For money. And you could have been one of them they were taken from. Or you were the one doing it. Take it however it resonates. From an empress? Show us a message for... Dang. This, this message is strong, Sagittarius. Ooh, someone is sad. They're in regret. Because it was all about greed. They wanted what they wanted when they wanted it. But they wasn't thinking. They wasn't thinking. They didn't do their homework on who you are. They didn't do their homework and that's what caused this, this grief, this loss. They may have thought that you was all so innocent. Oh, we can take from Sagittarius. Hmm. But didn't know how protected you are. Didn't know who you are. They had an idea, but they may not know who you are. You might not even know who you are or how powerful you are. So, they know now. Ooh, they know now. Show us a message for Sagittarius. Let's get more on this come together in reverse. Sagittarius, come together. Show us more. Come together in reverse. Ten of Cups. This could be a family. Yeah, but that is not coming back together. It's, it could be a marriage. Seven of Cups. Because it was built on illusions. I'm telling you. It's in the cards. But it's also intuitively coming through. Show us more. On this... Um, Hustler. Ooh. That's that greed. I'ma fight for whatever I'ma I'm a, whatever I gotta do to get it, I'ma get it. This that that kind of fight. I don't care who I gotta hurt. I don't care who who I gotta hurt. I'm gonna get mine. That's that. That's that energy. Yeah, okay. Show us more on the five of swords for such a serious. Someone could have been trying to plot on you, on your money. To try to take from you. Oh, they funny. They so funny, right? They funny. Yeah, I got a lot of fire in my chart too. Um, they got the knight of uh, knight of cups. They could have been. Ooh, we. It's like someone could have been playing on someone's heartstrings just to to get someone's money or to manipulate someone out of some money or out of just your energy. To feed them. Okay. Lockbox. Show us more on this lockbox. Closed in. Frustrated. Trapped. Yeah, they trapped. They can't get out. Because that's where they had you. Or they tried to have you. Show us more on this lockbox. Show us more on the lockbox. It's like someone was playing a love game with you. We got the devil. 
two of pentacles. Yeah, they was playing games. And then the eight of cups. They could have tried to play on your heartstrings and then walk away. Or play on play on you financially just to get some money out of you. Mm -hmm. Take, 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 take that greed. And then walk away with it. Oh, they was walking away. Felt like they was getting away with it. But nah, not no more. The devil was following them everywhere they go. <laughs> like, oh no, you got to pay me. <laughs> oh, the devil is coming to collect. Because the innocent is innocent. The innocent, whoever tried to uh, manipulate and destroy this innocent person, no matter the age, innocence is innocent. You doing no wrong in this world. You know what's right. You know what's wrong. You feel it in your soul. You don't have to be told what's right and what's wrong. You can feel it. If you a true being, divine being, you can feel it. You know what's right and what's wrong. So this person knew what was right and what's wrong. But they still chose to do what's wrong. So now they got to pay the consequences. They have to reap what they have sowed. Yep, the past is something is returning back to them. What they have done to you is being returned back to them. And it's for them to learn a lesson. It's for them to learn a lesson. Something is being returned. What goes around, comes around. And I'm going to leave it there. Um, I'm going to extend this though. I want to see more on this energy. So if you do want to extend it, definitely join me in Patreon. For more information on this and i will definitely give you that give you that um uh, and if not if not you can always just check out the next week video um that would be more than likely on the same day so thursday next week but uh i will be giving a weekend message so stay tuned for that that will always be on a weekend or that's what i'm striving for and also Monday, I will be doing Q&As. So for those who used to get Q&As with me, you can return. Um, those who just want to come and watch, you can do that as well. Just leave your negativity for those who are just coming to bring that. Because it definitely will be sent back tenfold. I promise you. Don't play with me. But um, yeah, for those who just want to watch, you can definitely come and watch. Um, just to see the truth, the proof, the accuracy within my readings um, without any cards or any tools. Uh, and yeah, I'll let y'all know on Monday. I'm not sure on the time yet. I was telling all the signs that I'm not too sure on the time, but I'll keep y'all informed. Um, just like I say, I always just keep the notification bell on. You may have to come back, check it, and make sure it's still on because sometimes some people... Say that the bill get deselected for whatever reason. So, you know, just make sure it's selected so you won't miss anything. Um, Cause I'm back. I'm back. I'm back, y'all. Um, many blessings. Until next time.